Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I am back with another video and for today's video I'm actually going to be doing something a little bit different that I've never done on my channel and it was actually requested by one of you guys. One of you guys was really interested into seeing what it is that I brought on my trip. Most of you guys should know by now but if you guys don't I am currently in Peru on vacation and although I'm here, I still have to plan, whether it be for YouTube or just for my own enjoyment. I went ahead and brought a couple of planning supplies with me here. So that's the reason why I'm making this video. So I'm just going to go ahead and jump right in. I wanted to go ahead and start with the planners that I actually brought on my trip. So the three planners that I brought on my trip were my On The Go Folio by Erin Condren. These are all by Erin Condren, by the way. My budget planner and my life planner. So I want to go ahead and first show you guys what it is that I have right here in my on-the-go folio. And it's pretty much what I had ever since I set it up. I really have been liking the setup. The only bad thing about this is that I have not been keeping up with my daily planner. As you guys can see, I didn't even finish the last couple of days. So I've been really bad about that. And it's really sad because I totally forgot my January one. So I have not been able to do anything for January either. So I haven't really been touching that one. I kind of tried to do it in the beginning of my trip. But I just got super busy with Vlogmas and getting my videos up. So I didn't really have time for it. Then I still do have my gratitude journal, which I have to definitely give more love to. And last but not least, I have my petite journal that I actually have been using a lot, whether it be for budgets or videos that I'm going to go ahead and post. So that's basically what I have. I still only have three, but this on the go folio, if you guys don't know, fits four petite journals. So I am definitely looking into getting another one, especially because Erin Condren just came out with a couple of new ones. So I'm super excited to order those. So that's pretty much what I have for here. And then on the side, if you guys have not checked out my whole setup of my on the go folio, you guys wouldn't know this, but I actually put two little corner pockets. So in here, I just have a couple of stickers. Mostly KPL plans to our Tuesdays and the petite planner stickers. So I have the gratitude one, the daily planner, budget, and the travel one. So that's where I put them just because it fits perfectly in the pocket there. So that's for this. The next, I like I said, I did bring my budget planner. And the reason why I brought it was because you guys know that I update you guys on my monthly budgets and my weekly by doing weekly check-ins and stuff like that so i definitely wanted to bring it so i can keep filming for you guys honestly i don't know if, if a regular person would bring it with them if i was on an action vacation and i didn't have to film these videos for you guys i would just put it on one of my petite journals and then bring it on to the planner once i get home just because it is pretty bulky to bring all the stuff but that's the reason why i brought it so i could go ahead and update you guys on my budget and then the last planner I have is my Erin Condren Colorful Hourly Life Planner. Now, if you guys have been seeing my last couple of videos, I've been doing plan with me's. I did a plan with me for this as well as for the first two weeks. So this is just how it's looking like right now. The reason I brought this planner with me was because I was going to start doing plan with me's for you guys. But as well as I really like to plan and it just de-stresses me at the end of the day. So I'm really happy that I brought it. But obviously a regular person I don't think would bring all of these planners with them. But I am, like I said, an exception. Now for the sort of pens that I brought... I brought just a couple. I think I have a couple more, but these are just the ones that I've actually been using. So I hauled this one. This is a One Smile With Love pen from her anniversary sale. This is just the Paper Mate Ink Joy 0.5. This is the Stadler Tri Plus Fine Liner um, pen. And then this is just my Slice Tool. I'll go ahead and link this down below because I did get this off Amazon, but it's just what I use to cut my washi and paper and stuff like that. So I really have been liking these. The only one that I, I think this was running out of ink and then this one hasn't really been working that great for me, but it's just what I brought. So whenever one doesn't work for me, I just go ahead and switch off from pen to pen, which is good that I brought different pens because if I would have just brought one, I would have just been stuck with that one. So next I want to go ahead and show you guys the stickers that I have. So I did bring a couple of stickers with me. Some of them are in the back of my budget planners as well as my life planner so let me show you guys what's in the back of this so here i just have 
the kits that I've been using for the weeks, and then some color block and Condren ones. So just stuff that I would use in my actual planner I have here. And then just more of those kits, as well as I have the one that I'm going to be using for next week. I have it all set up here. And then for my budget planner, I do have the budget stickers that I use, as well as just have some half boxes, some budget stickers by Planner K. As you guys can see, these are the ones that I use for my expenses, some dots, and then some metallic stickers, and then just some old budget stickers that I have there. I've been having these since I made the Christmas list, but I just have everything here that's budget related. And then I'm going to go ahead and just go on to the other ones that I have. These are just stickers that I brought that I thought I could possibly use here in Peru. So like I have some breakfast ones, ramen, some juice, some flight trackers. And I did use this in one of my plan with me. So I have been using a couple of these gym ones. These are for the sidebar. These are really old glam planner ones. Some packing to pack some drinks with friends because I do plan on hanging out with friends. And I just have some Chasing Chels ones. They're mostly characters, as you guys can see. So just things that I thought I would need is what I brought. I try to really limit myself to the things that I would use because I didn't want to bring too, too many things. But I, at the end of the day, I think I brought a pretty... a pretty good amount of stickers, not going to lie. Then I do have these Planner Kate sampler stickers these are some of the ones that i've bought as well as i've gotten in my orders and i thought it would it would just be perfect to bring them just so i don't have to bring even more stickers and these are small and would have pretty much what i need i have used some of these as you guys can see i think the ones that i use i use some build do right here and i don't think it's here but so i brought all of these i'm not gonna go ahead and go over these because i would just be such a long video but I also brought those and then last but not least for the stickers that I brought I definitely wanted to bring my four Erin Condren sticker books and the reason why I wanted to go ahead and bring these is because the stickers that Erin Condren has in their sticker books are very functional and could work with literally any spread that I were to use so I have a combination of functional stickers half boxes washi and scripts so I really like these and of course you guys know that I use these for my monthly budgets or social media planner and stuff like that and this is just the old one of that so I definitely wanted to bring these because I do utilize them a lot and I wanted to go ahead and just have them just in case I would need stickers any functional stickers these are perfect for that so I brought my Erin Condren sticker books and then last but not least I did bring my little photo albums with little tiny stickers. Most of these are once more with love stickers. And I've shown this before on my channel, but I'll just go ahead and show it really quickly again. And the reason I brought all of these is because I love character stickers. And I think these were perfect because they're super small. So even though I brought all three of them, it's not that much of a bulk. And I do have a bunch of stickers to choose from. So it really has been helping me and I really have been liking these. Although obviously I have not used every single sticker, I am glad that I have them just in case I need them. So that is pretty much it for the planning supplies, stickers, planners that I brought here on my trip. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys have any other suggestions for any other types of videos you guys would like to see on my channel, go ahead and do let me know. Like I said in the past, I would like to start taking requests so I can post videos that you guys want to see. So if you guys have any suggestions, go ahead and comment them down below. Please don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it. I know I try to go really fast because I had a couple of things, but to be honest, personally, this is what I would bring on my trips just because I love planning and I love having the stickers that I know I'm going to be using or stickers that I plan on using or having just in case with me just so I can go ahead and plan on the spot but obviously we're all different so you might want to bring even more stuff or even less things it just depends on each one personal preference so um yeah go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you guys are not subscribed already and tap on that notification bell just so you guys can get notifications whenever I upload a new video and I will see you guys in my next one bye guys <music>